Hi everyone, so, oh no, wait, I'm not doing that now, what am I doing? Hi, so uh, Ed is nearly here, because I'm such an idiot I forgot to record an intro to this video so that's why you're looking at a picture of a Christmas tree. Uh, so just trying to explain the whole purpose of this video is to create like a festive Christmas holiday makeup look, so carry on watching and I hope you really enjoy it. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to tie this uh, mess back. Yes, yeah, so I look like an umpa lump when I do this, if you see the top of my head. So then I'm going to go in with a chapstick just to hydrate my lips. So I'm going to work on my eyes first. Because that's what I always do. I'm going to go in with my Soap and Glory Brow Archery Dip Pot and Brush in the shade Dark Chocolate. Oh, I have eyebrows now. Then I'm just gonna like brush it out like makeup people do because I don't know what I'm doing. And then, because I am fancy, I'm gonna use the, is it Rimmel, Rimmel Brow This Way Brow Gel in the shade, what is the shade? Medium Brown. So then I'm going to go in with the Wimmel Wake Me Up, is it Wake Me Up? Wake Me Up concealer in the shade that I don't know. Oh, numbers 40, soft beige. I'm just going to prime my eyelids with that because that sounds fancy. And I'm just going to go in with this Makeup Revolution Pro Contour Palette thing and just take this pinky matte shade here just to like set matte. Eyes. Use my finger because why not? So because I'm trying to create like this Christmassy holiday look, um, I am going to be using the W7 in the Buff Lightly Toasted palette. This was like ridiculously cheap. I think it was like four pound or something. It's much like the it's um a dupe for the Urban Decay. Naked one palette because I can't be spending like £50 on a nice shadow palette. <laughs> and then I'm gonna go in with this body collection palette that I just have. Uh, I've had this a really long time, probably shouldn't have had it this long, but um, this is what it looks like if it focuses. There we go. Um, there's like millions of colours in here, there's like so many, it makes me happy. So we'll be uh, using that as well. Then I'm gonna go in with this body collection palette and I'm gonna take this green here what well, a mixture of these two greens, all these two. And I'm gonna put those on the outer third of my eyeball. Well, I did. So then I obviously my eyes look a mess but I'll clean it up after. Um, then I'm going to go in with this like goldy colour, goldy colour here and just pack that on the inner third of my eye. That's that practically done. Then I'm going to go and do some eyeliner off camera because I can't do eyeliner on camera so I will be right back. Oh my god, hi, I'm back. So then I'm going to move on to face and I'm going to prime my face with the collection Prime and Ready mattifying pore minimizer primer thing and uh, I'm just gonna pop that all over my face so even though my spots are really 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 bad at the moment I'm just gonna use this MUA skin defined hydro foundation in beige it's a really light coverage it's obviously water-based really like this I haven't used it for quite a long time and I like the fact that it's quite light coverage and in the places I need to I can build it up with concealer
I never normally put two layers of foundation on but my skin is especially bad today so this is happening for the one of the first time so I'm gonna go in with three different concealers today I'm gonna go in with my uh, Maybelline instant anti-age the eraser I concealer and put that under my eyes obviously um, then I'm going to put the Rimmel Wipe Me Up concealer on top of that just as a brightening thing and then the, collac the collection the collection last imperfection concealer in warm medium which is number three To set all of my face, I'm going to use these two matte setting powders from the uh, Makeup Revolution palette because it's literally like my favourite thing in the history of the world ever. I love it so much. And I'm just going to like pop those all over my face, especially focusing it in the places oh, I'm not in focus. Now I am. Um, especially focusing it on the places I've just put all the concealer. And then just going to go in with this little nice brush here and take this really cool toned contour shade and just try and contour my face then I'm gonna take this shade here I'm just gonna do my brow don't want any blush for this look I'm not really a blush person so I'm gonna go straight into contour contour I'm gonna go straight into highlight, you'll never guess what I'm going to be using. That's right, the Makeup Revolution palette. So I'm gonna go in with this contour shade here, which is a nice champagne colour, and then this like stark white one just over the top to make it pa. Pa. Hi, hello there. So I uh, I finished recording this video about an hour ago realize that I forgot to put mascara on that's what I'm going to do now literally I'm just using this number seven uh, intense volume mascara in black so sorry for interrupting the video um, I'll put this in and go back to other me earlier who didn't realize that she didn't put mascara on and see the finished look and all that jazz so yeah. Normally if I was doing a look like this I'd go for a dark lip, um, I'd probably go for NYX Copenhagen which I have like right there but I'm not going to because I've got college in like I don't know how long so I'm just going to go for like a nude lip. So I'm going to go in with Velvet Teddy, you can't read that, Velvet Teddy by MAC. And finally I'm gonna set myself my set myself set myself set my face with the Avon Prime and Set Spray because you know it's in the setting spray I get I'm gonna shake it don't know if you're meant to shake it are you meant to shake it and then you let that dry so this is the finished look I'll give you a, a close-up of the eye makeup if you want that I don't know if you do can you even see it? I don't know if you can. But I really like it. Um, so that is the finished look. I really, really, really hope you enjoyed this video. Um, if I don't see you before Christmas, hopefully I will. I hope you have a brilliant Christmas. Hope you get everything that you want. Um, and yeah, don't forget to like this video. Comment down below if you liked it. Um, and subscribe. See that button down there. Is that the right side? Is that the right side? I don't know. Um, just click subscribe, please. Thank you. Love you. Bye.